morning, everyone. Um, my name is Judy Van Rassen. I'm Executive Vice President of the International Republican Institute. And on behalf of IRI, I am pleased to welcome you to this session of our Democratic Governance Speaker Series. It's a forum designed to bring policymakers and practitioners together to discuss challenges to governance and to share experiences in meeting those challenges. Like other regions of the world, in Latin America and the Caribbean, democratic institutions face persistent challenges, from security threats to poor service delivery and corruption. Citizens have little trust in institutions that, in many cases, often fail to deliver. As part of an institute-wide program, IRI initiated democratic governance in Latin America in early 2007, funded by the National Endowment for Democracy. Through these programs, IRI works alongside mayors, governors, civil servants, and other government officials to encourage transparent, accountable, and responsive governing practices. In addition, IRI educates citizens on their role in the process, helps local civil society organizations con contribute to policy design and oversight, and empowers media to more accurately serve in the public's interest. Today, we will discuss the use of information and communications technology in support of democratic governance, or as we call it, smart governance. We hope to gain a better appreciation and understanding of how technology can be applied as a tool to strengthen democratic institutions, improve democratic processes, ultimately transforming the way citizens interact with their government. It is my great pleasure to introduce Constance Barry Newman, who will moderate today's panel discussion. Connie has an enormously impressive background. While she has focused on issues affecting Africa, her experience is wide-ranging, encompassing law, business, and government. Some highlights of her career include serving as Assistant Secretary of State for African Affairs. She acted as President Bush's G8 personal representative on Africa, playing an advisory role to the Secretary of State and guide, guiding the operation of the U.S. diplomatic establishment in the countries of Sub-Saharan Africa. Prior to that, she was the Assistant Administrator for Africa at USAID and led efforts to administer economic and humanitarian assistance in Africa. In addition to several other government positions, such as overseeing the U.S. Civil Service and managing the Smithsonian Institution, Connie was a successful business owner, and she has hands-on experience with the issue of governance when she served as a board member and vice chair of the District of Columbia's Financial Responsibility and Management Assistant Authority. Connie has helped IRI in a variety of programs, including governance, when this spring she spoke and participated in IRI's second regional smart governance summit implementing best practices and lessons.